Well, now at 630, we want to get back to some breaking news from Waco. Take a look at this. That is the damage left behind after a car slammed into a house this morning. That car was just removed. Meredith Haas is live on the scene. And Meredith, what is the latest there? Anyone inside at the time? Good morning, Jasmine. I just want to show everyone what happened here at the 3100 block of Cole Avenue. It was around 325 this morning that a car went across a whole two houses to this area to leave this gaping hole in this home this morning. Waco police tells us everyone inside the home is OK. But as for the people who were in that car that hit the house, well, they are yet to be found this morning. They left the scene. Let me tell you exactly what happened. So you see this wall right here. This is where one of the renters was actually sleeping and you see that hole all the way back there across the room. Well, that's where his head landed when he was flown across the room from this car hitting this home. Now, luckily, his name is Ryan. He is OK this morning. He has a few scrapes and bruises. Now, the other renter, the girlfriend who lived in this house, lives in this house. She was in the other room at the time, but she is OK. She says that when she heard this crash happen, she she was scared because she thought, well, it sounded like gunshots, but she smelled smoke. She saw glass and she immediately went to calling 911 to make sure she could take care of the scene. But something she also heard was a lot of aggression from the drivers that were in this car that crashed into this home. So it's an inter interesting thing to note. But again, we don't know where those drivers are this morning. They fled the scene and as for whether the car has insurance. Well, it's interesting to note Waco PD says they do not. So as for what this home and these renters will do moving forward, they say they don't know. They have to wake up. They have to wait for their um, renters to wake up and tell them how they're going to move forward through this process. But again, a crazy scene out here at the 3100 block of Cole Avenue in Waco. Live in Waco, I'm Meredith Haas. Back to you. Okay, thank you, Meredith. I know people are shaking up this morning. Do police have any idea if we're looking for males, females, anybody in the car, anything other than them just being suspects? No, nothing from police this morning as to who they are, but the renter I spoke to, her name's Kaylee George. She did mention that she heard a kid talking and there were multiple people in the car. She did meet, mention it was a Nissan, but as for police, they don't have any other information except for where it happened and the scene that you have right here. But we will keep everyone up to date, finding that information as to who these drivers could be. But for right now, we just, we know what happened right here, Jasmine. Okay, thank you, Meredith. Got to wait for the police to do their work. Okay, thank you so much for that report.